Dear Miss Ari, it was in 2006 when you said, I am not my hair. It was iconic. And it sat well with me as I undid my three-month-old cornrows that didn't resemble cornrows anymore because I was too lazy to undo them sooner and they didn't look that bad, right? No, they, they totally did. But I digress. Some people would think it's just hair, that it's not that deep. But actually, it kind of is. The truth is, it's the difference between wearing that dress that makes me feel beautiful and all sorts of I am here, or the one that's just a safer option right now. It's the difference between an extra layer of foundation or the size of earrings I choose to wear that day just to make sure that things are, you know, balanced. I know I'm not my hair, Miss Ari, but sometimes it's the difference between people thinking I'm Mama Africa or a rebellious teenager fighting the system. I mean, we all know the elevated state a black woman enters into when she's just left the hair salon. Or that cry we release when we get home because the new style we were excited about came out terribly and now we have to repent for wishing calamity on the lying hairstylist who said she could do it. I've grown my daughter's hair and I see how she loves it, but she still puts a towel on her head and pretends it's longer than it is. She has the brown skin dolls and loves her afro puffs, but when I see the towel and how she lights up, I wonder if I'm doing enough or if I'm overthinking and that she's just a kid playing pretend and being a kid. I know I already mentioned overthinking, but I think it's my secret weapon because overthinking and intense research is why and how I will spend two hours parting my hair to make sure my twists eventually come out perfect. At this point, I have a PhD from the Natural Hair University of YouTube. Thank you very much. Maybe it's not that deep. It's simple. I just want to look pretty like every other woman. So here I am 12 hours in with another DIY hair project, praying it comes out right. I even remember that one time I did it, hated it, undid it, and started again the next day. Okay, maybe that was probably overboard, but Miss Ari, you're right. I'm not my hair. But my hair is me. Like when someone sees something I'd like and my phone goes ping with a picture of it and a message that reads, yo, this jacket is so you. I'm not my hair, Miss Ari, but my hair is me. It's so me.